I'm Sean O'Donnell, and I'm going to demonstrate for you how I fly using hand controls. This is the Sky Arrow 600 LSA, and it is equipped with a factory installed hand control option. Here's how it works. The airplane can be flown with either the standard rudder pedals or with this extra stick that controls the movement of the rudder and throttle. The stick can be installed or removed in just a few seconds, and the rudder pedals can be adjusted out of the way if needed. To control the rudder, you simply push forward for right rudder or pull to the rear for left rudder. To operate the throttle, you just twist the stick to increase or decrease the power. As with any airplane, you operate the aileron and the elevator with the standard controls. In this case, the control stick is on the right. Notice too that the Sky Arrow has finger controlled brakes next to the right stick. Now let me show you what this looks like in flight. When using full power for takeoff and climb, the Sky Arrow turns to the left. So you need to add and hold right rudder to compensate and keep the nose where you want it. When power is reduced for cruise, you release the rudder input and you can adjust the amount of rudder needed with the handy electric trim on top of the right stick. In level flight, it's easy to see how the optional rudder control works. Watch the nose as I add left rudder and then add right rudder. Again, pushing on the stick moves the nose to the right and pulling moves the nose to the left. On landing, you simply add the amount of rudder you need to keep the nose straight over the runway. Or, if you have a crosswind, keeping the nose where you want it to be. And that's it. It's a simple and effective way of flying with hand controls.